And so I'm going to record. All right. Thank you. Let me just double okay. check that it's going. Um, okay, it's going. Okay. Thank you. Um, aloha, everyone. Welcome to our science call tonight. And I want to thank Dr. Sean Talbot um, from the bottom of our hearts because he is actually um, coming in live tonight from Utah from Salt Lake City area. So the time zone there, I think, is about four hours ahead of us. Right. But he does this, you know, um, because he loves us here in Hawaii. And, <laughs> and, and I think that he has a real passion for what he does with educating and sharing his knowledge with everyone. So thank you so much, Dr. Sean. Um, you know, I usually we start these calls by um, going over Dr. Sean's credentials. But I think what I'll do is maybe post a link to Dr. Sean's credentials in the chat box and everyone can go there later on. Um, what I'd like to focus on tonight, which might be more relevant, is that to share with you that Dr. Sean Talbot is not only the Chief Science Officer at Amari Global, but he's also the formulator of all of the natural supplements that um, you know consist of our, our product line. Yeah. And I think that so many of you on the call today are you using the Amari supplements. And so he, he is go on, but... in, um, in, uh, in, in nutrition, he is a biochemist, nutritional biochemist, and he is an expert on how our bodies utilize nutrition in a natural way for, to optimize our health. And if you can if you can think about that, uh, that also means that he's an expert in um, the systems of the body, right? So our nervous system, uh, cardiovascular system, ha uh, and, and in particular, our immune system. And so what we've asked Dr. Sean to focus on tonight is a little bit of that immune system part. And uh, given a lot of the concern that, you know, we're all experiencing. Um, my name is Robin Stuber. I am a wellness partner based here in Honolulu with Amari Global. And um, I've been a uh, customer and user of the Amari supplements for the last two years. And I've been active in the business for maybe about a little bit over a year now. Um, this is, uh, it, it's been an interesting experience of just even the last seven days um, with businesses uh, being forced to really curtail their activities, restaurants and bars closing. And a lot of stress out there in the general community, not only with regarding our health, but the economy as well. And Amari Global is a mental wellness company. And everything that we do with the products that Dr. Sean has formulated, our programs, and our people is centered around this idea of mental wellness. And right now, that is so important. So I'm so glad that each and every one of you has joined us online today because I think you will find all of this information uh, very valuable, um, extremely valuable, whether you're a, a, a customer and using the products now, or if you're thinking about and evaluating a decision to try the products. So without further ado, I'll turn this over to Dr. Sean Talbot. Oh, one more thing before I do that. Um, Dr. Sean will give his presentation and then we will open up to questions. If you have a question along the way, please put that question in the chat box. There should be a little um, chat uh, button at the bottom of your screen. You may be on your mobile phone. You might want to kind of you know, punch around and see if you can find it. Um, if you have a question while he's doing his presentation, please put that in the chat box and he can address it at the end. But we, um, you know, we, we, if we have time, we will open up to live questions um, after Dr. Sean has gone through the questions in the chat. So without further ado, Dr. Sean Talbot, thank you so much for being with us. All right. Thank you, Robin. Thanks for everyone for, for jumping on tonight. And what I'm going to try to do is, is, is give um, kind of an abbreviated presentation of what I did uh, a couple of nights ago about the immune system. So on March 3rd, um, I did a really extensive deep dive into how the immune system works, how you can strengthen it, the kinds of foods you want to eat, the kinds of supplements that you want to take, you know, things about washing your hands and, you know, all that kind of stuff. So I did a really, really extensive deep dive on March 3rd about the immune system. Then the next Tuesday, which is the 10th, 
I did a little bit shorter version of it, but, but, but talked more about the linkage between the immune system and what we do here at Amari, mental wellness. And then this past Tuesday, I did kind of a three part where I talked about the three things that people are really concerned with right now. One is your immune system. One is your stress levels. And one is the fact that all the kids are home from school now because all the schools are closed and everybody needs to think about mental focus and you know being able to be calm and engaged and still get your work done, right? So um, that's what I wanna try to do a little bit tonight is to talk about those three things because they're all really linked together. Um, we're, we're the mental wellness company at Amare and I think people are sometimes a little bit uh, surprised that the immune system plays such a big role in mental wellness. And it's not from the perspective that you think. It's not from the perspective of, um, you know, the logical perspective, which be, you know, which would be, well, if I'm, if I'm sick, I'm probably not going to feel as good as I want to feel, right? If I'm, if I'm ill, my mental wellness will probably be low. That, that's, that's totally true. But there's another aspect to it too. If your immune system is working better, that will signal wellness in your body and you'll feel better. We can measure that. And that's separate from, are you sick or are you not sick? And so I want to give you guys a perspective for that because quite a bit of what we've been doing at Amari since the day we started is strengthening the immune system. But we're, we were doing it from the perspective of if we strengthen your immune system in the right way, that can help you feel better. It can help with your mental wellness. It can help with your mood help with your energy levels. It can help with your ability to focus. It can help with your stress levels and your ability to be resilient in the face of stress. So that's why we were doing it. As a nice side benefit to, to, to strengthening the immune system to help you feel better, the side benefit was your immune system is stronger and it's more able to ward off and protect us from the things that we want it to protect us from. The immune system chiefly protects us from three things, bacteria, cancer cells and viruses and viruses are really in the news now because of coronavirus so everybody is asking me hundreds of times every day lately what can i do to strengthen my immune system and i say well you know what the things that you have been doing at amari since the very very beginning to help you feel better in terms of your mental wellness are also strengthening your immune system. So I wanna walk you guys through that a little bit because if we do that, it's gonna protect us. If we do that, it's gonna help with our stress levels. If we do that, it's gonna help with our mental focus, which is one part of the whole mental wellness continuum. Okay, so um, if, if everything crashed right now, you guys have all the information that you need, right? I just sort of summarized everything, everything that you need to hear tonight. But I'm going to go through my slides and give you the, give you, you know, some of the details. Um, if you want more details than what I go through tonight, I put a couple of bullet points here of other places where I post this kind of information. So you can go to amari.com and you can get detailed information about any of the products that I'm going to talk about tonight. You can go to my blog site, which is seantalbot.com, where I post up all the slides that I use in all these presentations and the recordings of these presentations. So you can click on any of those videos and it'll pop up on YouTube and you'll be able to watch the video just, just, like, you're, just like you're doing now. But you can also download the slides if you wanna have those as your, as your own personal library of, of, of information. Or you can go straight to YouTube. Uh, and you know, in, go to YouTube and type in Dr. Sean Talbot. You go to my channel, and you'll you'll be able to see all the videos there. Okay, so we try to make this information as as you know as 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 available and as consumable and as shareable as possible because you might find some interest in this and you might want to you know copy the link and share the link with somebody else that you know so they can they can watch this information as well um, so when we talk about mental wellness at Amare we, we very often will try to get across to people that how you feel is not just in your head, right? It's not just because of the brain in your head. It might also be because of the brain in your gut, what we call the second brain, or the brain in your heart, what we call the third brain. All of those three brains have a, have a, have a concentration of neurons that provide information to the rest of the body. So what's happening in the gut is a lot of neurotransmitter production, things like serotonin and dopamine and norepinephrine, the kinds of chemicals that help us 
feel a particular way. So serotonin to help us be happy, dopamine for motivation, norepinephrine for focus, GABA to help us relax. Most of that production happens in the gut and, and chiefly happens in the, in the bacteria in your gut, what we call the microbiome. So if we want to feel as good as possible here in the brain in our head, we have to look at where some of those primary signals are coming from. They're coming from the gut in the first place. So that's, a, that's why we talk a lot about the gut-brain axis at Amari. Or, so, so neurotransmitters being produced in the second brain having a signaling effect here in the first brain. That's the gut-brain axis. The heart-brain axis are the electrical signals that the heart will send to the brain and will change your brainwave patterns. And they can change in a positive direction that, so that you're, 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 you're more energetic and more focused and you can have good mental performance and physical performance. Or they can go in a negative direction and you can have more stress and more irritability and more tension and things like that. So if we can get the right signals from the gut, we feel better. If we can get the right signals from the heart, we feel better. But the way that these three brains in your head, your gut, and your heart communicate with each other is what we call the axis. And that axis, when we say gut-brain axis or heart-brain axis, the axis is the communication network that, that takes those signals from one place of the body to the other. So from the gut to the brain, or from the brain to the gut, or from the heart to the brain, et cetera, et cetera. You get it, right? We can go through all the different, all the different permutations. But that signaling system is, is partly going through your nervous system, partly going through your cardiovascular system, your bloodstream, but in large part, it's going through your immune system. And so your immune system, you know, people don't think about their immune system typically until they get sick or until there's some sort of threat in the environment like there is right now, then people get very concerned about their immune system. But your immune system, like I said at, at the very beginning of this call, isn't just a shield, isn't just there to protect us, it's also there to be like a, like a systems check, right? It really is the surveillance system, so much so that we really think of the immune system as a, as a, as a seventh sense. And, I'll, and I'll, I'll, I'll explain more what I mean by that as we go through. But you know, by just by focusing on your immune system, we can get it to send these signals more efficiently. And that in and of itself helps us feel better. That's why we focus on it so much here at Amare. So any of the products that we have in our line, 22 products across our product line right now, they will all help people feel better. Some of them work more through the immune system to do that feeling better. Some of them will work more through your stress response system to help you feel better. They all work some way to help you feel better. And so what I wanna to do tonight is focus on the ones that are gonna help you feel better through your immune system, the ones that are gonna help you feel better through your stress response system, because those are two things that really feed, feed on each other. Let me give you an example of that before I go any further. When we're under a lot of stress, right? If we're thinking about you know, the, 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 the coronavirus panic every single day, we're worried about it, uh, we're worried about the fact that it might be pushing a lot of us out of our jobs, uh, we could be worried about how it's gonna affect our families, we could be worrying um, so much that we're not getting good, a, a good night's sleep. Any of those sources of stress, stress of worry, stress of sleep deprivation, stress can lead us to start eating a lot of junk food, right? So stress of a poor diet because we're eating garbage instead of good healthy food. Any of those sorts of stress can lower your immune system, right? Suppress your immune system. That's the exact opposite of what we need right now. So the best response would be something that brings your immune system activity back up to normal and reduces your stress and improves your sleep quality and improves how you feel so that now you can go out and do something that's proactive so that now you're less stressed just because you're you're in motion right not i mean i don't mean going out because we're not supposed to be going out with other people but just the fact that you can do something actively to improve any of those parameters that's going to reduce your stress level as well um, and i you know i gave a webinar this morning for a group of women who are really sort of high achievers right they're they're go-getters and they're like all right 
tell us what we can do. We feel paralyzed. We want to do something. So I gave them a whole list of things to do. And it was, you know, it was funny because I was going through all the biochemistry and physiology of the immune system and stuff. And one of the women stopped me and she goes, listen, we trust you. Just tell us what to do. And so I actually made a slide for you guys at the very end of this presentation tonight that just says what to do. Okay, um, and and I and I have one of those slides in one of my earlier presentations too. Let me go. Let me go here and 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 uh, check the mute button again real quick because I have a little bit of background noise. Okay, there. You should still be able to hear me. So uh, so what I want to do now is just is step through some of those products and explain how they work why you might be interested in them, and then give you a little bit of a, of, a, of a hack, if I can, about how you might want to take it during this time when we're all sort of you know, under a higher level of stress. Okay, so our, 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 our fundamentals pack that you can see on the screen right now is probably the first place to start for most people because it does so much. So this is our, this is our overall gut-brain access system. So you've got a product here for the gut, mentabiotics, a product for the brain, Mentafocus, and a product for the immune for the for the axis, but largely the immune system, called Mentasync. And each one of them individually will help you feel better. But when you're when they're used in in conjunction with each other, they really do have a synergistic effect. And I want to give you a, give you a perspective for what that means as we go through here. So this Mentabiotics product is a collection of probiotic bacteria, so good healthy bacteria prebiotic fibers, and then phytobiotics, which are plant extracts that help with signaling across that axis portion of the gut-brain axis. And so, you know, it's, it's um, I'm going to show you a cartoon of this in just, a, in just a second about why it's important for us to focus not just on the immune system, but the other parts of the body kind of simultaneously. Um, Whenever I'm talking about how to protect your body, uh, there's sort of there's kind of three levels that you can go through. One is to protect yourself at the cellular level. So each individual cell in your body is less susceptible to damage or stress or infection or something like that, right? You can do that at the, at the cellular level. You can protect yourself at the cellular level with the right vitamins, the right minerals, the right phytonutrients. That's something like VitaGBX, and I'll talk about that later. In this product, in Mentabiotics product, we have these phytobiotics, which are plant extracts that are really high in these compounds called flavonoids or polyphenols. We know that those kinds of plant extract compounds have antiviral qualities to them. It's one of the ways that plants protect themselves from viruses. And when we ingest those plant compounds, that helps to protect our cells from viruses and all kinds of other stresses too. So the phytobiotics are an important piece of that. The probiotics and the, pre and the prebiotics are an important piece of that because gut health is an important aspect of overall immune system function. So we can protect the individual cells in our body, but we can also protect the microbiome cells, the bacterial cells, because those are what tell your immune system what to do in the first place. In a lot of ways, your microbiome and your gut health, your gut integrity, will orchestrate what your immune system does. If you have a good gut, your immune system is going to be stronger and more vigilant and more able to protect you and more able to fight off some sort of a threat. If you have a bad gut, that can lead to immune system suppression. That can lead to a weaker immune system. And if you have a weaker immune system, that can lead to problems with your gut integrity. So it's sort of a, it's almost a chicken and egg scenario of, do you want to have a strong immune system? Well, you need to have a strong gut. If you want to have a strong gut, you need to have a strong immune system. So protecting cells is step one. Protecting your gut and your immune system is step two. And then step three is going after the immune system itself specifically. So this product, Mentabiotics, is going to protect at the cellular level and at the gut microbiome level. Okay, so, so I'm, going to, I'm, I'm going to leave that there. Um, when we look at Mentafocus, this is particularly, so this is a, this is a product that's going to work in the brain. It's going to work to help with focus and alertness and memory and speed of processing in your brain. It's also going to help to calm your brain so you can take that energy, that mental energy, and you can focus it in a very engaged and useful way. So that's great. 
how in the world can this have any benefits for 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 your immune system and for your for your body's protection well the way that we get those mental focus benefits is by using phytonutrients like pomegranate extract apple fruit extract grape seed extract um, um, new zealand pine bark extract those are all really high in those polyphenol flavonoids I'm gonna stop for one second. Okay, I think, I think I just froze for a second, so I'm gonna go back and repeat what I just said. The way that we get those mental wellness benefits in the brain for focus and mental energy and things like that, they come from very high polyphenol, very high flavonoid compounds like pomegranate extract, grapeseed extract, apple fruit extract, New Zealand pine bark extract. So we're using them to get a mental focus benefit, but because they're so high in those, those flavonoid polyphenol compounds, they also have that antiviral effect that I mentioned before, that, that, that plants make these compounds to protect themselves, and by, by us ingesting those plant compounds, we bring that protection on board into our human bodies. So that's why this would be effective. But the one that is really probably the most effective of the whole line, if we're talking specifically about immune system issues, is meant to sink. And I know Amari did a uh, did a special um, special promotion on meant to sink, where there were there, you know there were three bottles offered for for a special price, and it sold out in almost no time. Right, so that's not on offer anymore, unfortunately, because so many people took advantage of it. It basically blew out our inventory. But this product will do something that's called immune system priming. That priming effect will take a suppressed immune system back up to normal and will also take an overactive immune system down to normal. And it's that primed balance point that's really, really important to help you feel better, but it's also really, really important to get your immune system to focus on the things that it's supposed to focus on, viruses, bacteria, cancer cells, but also not to fight against other things that are, are, are healthy, like our cells. If you have an overstimulated immune system, what it can often do is start to, start to damage your own gut lining or start to damage your mucous membranes or attack your skin or attack your joints. Those are what we would call autoimmune system conditions. And that's because your immune system is overactive. That's not where we wanna be. So when I hear people talking about, oh, what you need to do these days is stimulate your immune system, I say no. That's actually not what you want to do. If you're low, you want to get yourself up to normal, sure, but you don't want to go above normal. That priming effect is a really, really different kind of an effect. And we get it in this meant to sink product through these compounds called beta glucans that come from yeast and alpha glucans that come from mushrooms. So these are very, very specialized plant extracts. I guess not plants because yeast and uh, yeast and mushrooms are 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 are, are um, specifically they're 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 fungi, uh, so they're not technically plants, but they're 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 a, they're a sh like a sugar structure, a polysaccharide structure that your immune cells will gobble up, and that will tell them to pay attention. Pay attention because there's something that might be a threat here, and if we encounter that threat, we want you, the immune system to jump into activity as quickly as possible to clear that out. So this is a really, really unique kind of a product. Um, again, the reason that we've been using it since day one at Amare is because of this. It can help you feel better. And this is one of the reasons that I've been telling people, like right now, I'm taking Menta Sync three times a day. You know, if I'm, if I'm in a low stress situation, I'm taking it once a day. I'm taking it with my, with my fundamentals every single morning. If I'm in a sort of a medium high stress situation, like when I travel, for example, I'll take, I'll take all my fundamentals products, including Menta Sync, twice a day. When I travel, I very often take it in the morning before I go out to my meetings, and I take it again in the evening when I come back to my hotel room, right? Nowadays, because my stress level is higher and my potential exposure level is higher, I want to match that, my body's buffering capacity or my, buff, my, my body's shielding capacity, I want to match that. So that's why I'm taking it at three times a day. Once this, once this craziness goes away, I'll probably go back to, you know, and my stress levels come down, 
I'll go back down to a, to a different usage once a day or twice a day. But right now I'm taking it three times a day. Hopefully that makes sense to everybody. Um, so the reason we're doing that is because the immune system is really nowadays thought of as not just that shield, like I've said a couple of times already. It really is the systemic surveillance system. It's how our brain and our immune system communicate. It's how our gut communicates with our brain. And we really think of it as this, uh, as this new kind of organ in our body that generates senses, right? And generates surveillance of our internal environment and our external environment. And that's, you know, if we do that, if we put all of that together with mentabiotics, and meant to sync and meant to focus that fundamentals pack. We know we've, we've done clinical trials to show that we can improve the microbiome. And as a result of that, people feel better. So if you just want that, right? If you're not concerned about, you know, contracting the coronavirus or getting sick or anything like that, right? If you're good, then why not just do fundamentals to help you feel better? right? To lower your tension and lower your anger and lower your fatigue and all that kind of stuff. You're just going to feel better. Like I think a lot of people would want that. But the reason that we get this is because in, in between here, in between what we're doing with the, with the microbiome in the gut and in between what we're getting in the brain in terms of that psych, psychological benefit, the in-between part is that immune system vigilance, right? So you're getting this protection just as a side benefit, even if that's not your focus. And, uh, and of course, if it is your focus, then, 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 then absolutely do this. And the, and, the, and the reason we get such good effects with the fundamentals pack in so many people in so many different ways is because it's a system that really modulates all of these different kinds of things that could potentially be out of balance when we're under stress and you know all, when we're not getting enough sleep and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And so right now we've done, we've done probably a dozen different scientific presentations or peer reviewed scientific journal articles that have been, you know, distributed. We actually just got a new publication the other day that I don't want to tell you about right now, um, but I will tell you about maybe next week, maybe the week after that. So we're going to have a big announcement around it. It's really, really exciting stuff. Um, one of the challenges right now, though, with all of our science is that because of the way the world is, uh, a lot of these scientific conferences are getting, are getting canceled. Um, I had, uh, I've had two scientific conferences canceled where I was giving big presentations. Um, and so, you know, what I'll do, what I'll do in the coming weeks is I'll give those presentations here online and let everybody see the, you know, see the data around that. Some of the data is around our project B3 yeah. program. Some of the data is around our kids mood plus program. Um, some of the data is around our mental heart. Um, uh, uh, supplement. So cross your fingers that no more of these, uh, that no more of these get canceled. And if they do get canceled, we'll just, you know, we're just going to roll with it and go, go virtual and still get the information out to people as much as we can. Okay. So now what I want to do is, is, is kind of shift gears a little bit, right? Fundamentals does a lot. It does the immune system piece. It does the cellular protection piece. It does the mood state improvement piece so that people have better mental wellness. I want to shift gears a little bit and talk a little bit about specific ingredients across our product line that can help with stress levels because stress is at an all time high right now for a lot of people. Um, every time you pick up your phone, unless you're Robin and have a smashed phone, um, every time you pick up your phone or turn on the TV or open the newspaper right now, it, it's, it's just blaring at you all the doom and gloom, right? So that's going to be, that's the very definition of what we call chronic stress, right? It's this constant, constant input. And like I said before, if you have a constant input that's really, really high, there's two ways that you can protect yourself from that. One is to lower the input, right? Shut off the news. Don't check your phone. Uh, just, you know, go on a, on, on a social media fast a little bit from that kind of stuff. You still want to connect with people. You still want to share information. You still want to support other people and things like that. But boy, if you can lower that, 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 that stress input, that's going to be good for everybody. But for a lot of people, that's not going to be very realistic, right? If you have family, you have, you maybe you have parents you need to take care of. Maybe you have kids you need to take care of. Maybe you need to be, you know, 
connected and engaged with all that kind of stuff. So your stress level is still going to be high. It's not practical for you to lower that down. So if that's the situation, the next piece is that you need to raise your buffering capacity. You need to raise your resilience so that you can meet that so that your body doesn't start breaking down. So you don't get that immune system suppression. So you don't get the detrimental effects of stress. And some of the ingredients that I'm gonna talk about now can help you with that, can help you lo lower your stress response, um, have better resilience, and, and actually in a lot of ways be able to thrive in the face of that high stress load, which is what a lot of us need to do right now to take care of the people around us, okay? So one of these ingredients is theanine. Theanine is an amino acid that's naturally found in green tea leaves. Um, we, use a, we use a brand called Sun Theanine, very, very pure source that comes out of Japan. And the reason that we use this is because it can very, very quickly help to turn the, the volume down on a stress response. So when we're stressed and we're irritable and we're anxious, we have a lot of brain waves that are, that are called beta waves. Theanine can take those beta waves and replace them with alpha waves. It can increase the production of alpha waves in your brain. Why do you care about that? You care about that because alpha waves are associated not with irritability and tension like beta waves are, but they're associated with relaxed alertness. So if you were an athlete, these alpha waves would be what you would be giving off when you're in the zone. And so when you're in the zone, you have good focus, you're relaxed, things are almost in slow motion because you are, you are just so on top of everything. You're just, you know, you are, you're like a, you're like a ninja, right? You're a superhero if you have a lot, of, a lot of alpha waves, a lot of this relaxed alertness feeling. And that can come on very, very quickly. 45 minutes, 60 minutes, 75 minutes, you can see a very, very fast onset of action. This sun theanine is in mentabiotics and it's in kids fundamentals. That's why when you mix up that powder and drink it down, within about an hour's time, people are going, whew, all right, yeah, I think, I think I'm good. I think my tension is coming down. I think my ability to have a normal stress response instead of an overactive stress response is a lot better. So you know, those two products, even though we think of them as sort of gut products, they can be products that you might wanna take a couple of times a day if you're feeling a little bit anxious because of you know, all the turmoil that's going on around us, okay? So that's, a, that's, that's, that's one of several ingredients. This pomegranate extract that I mentioned before, which is really high in those flavonoids that have those antiviral uh, um, um, perspectives, this is in our mentabiotic, or I'm sorry, mentafocus product. We use this to enhance brain activation because it makes our memory better and it makes our, our brain be able to work quicker, but it also helps to relax us. Um, this, this, what, what I'm circling right here now with my cursor is showing the area of the brain that is involved in fear and panic and threat. And if we can dial that down a little bit, that helps us to be calm and focused and engaged when we need to. So, you know, part of focus is getting the brain to do more work. But the other part of focus is that we want to relax the brain enough so that you can use that ability to do more work in a, in a, a sort of a focused way. The best way to focus is to sort of get a 50-50 blend of, of, of stimulation and relaxation. Those sound like opposite things, but because they happen in different parts of the brain, they're actually very, very complementary to each other. So meant focus is something that can be used a couple of times a day if you want to, sort of as needed if you're starting to get that kind of stress-induced brain fog that a lot of us get, okay? So that's, a, you know, that's one thing that we can use. Our Energy Plus product, one of the reasons that Energy Plus is such a unique product is because it gives you physical energy, which is what a lot of people think of when they're thinking of energy, but it gives you mental energy and it gives you mental awareness. So the mental awareness piece is a different way of helping you sort of engage and connect with whatever it is that you're trying to focus on. We get that with this herb that we get out of South America, Ecuador, 
um, uh, called, called wayusa. It looks like a green tea leaf, but it's actually a completely, completely different kind of a plant. This has bioactive compounds in it that get the brain to, to, to not just focus, but to be aware of its surroundings, right? So that, that idea of being aware of what's happening around you can help you reduce your stress. We also have another ingredient in our Energy Plus product. And this one we actually use in several products. This enzogenol is a very unique New Zealand pine bark extract that can do this. It can take an overactive kind of agitated brain, what we call the monkey mind, right? Where your brain is sort of going and can't focus and you don't know what to do with this, this sort of tense energy and really calm it in a way that helps with focus and concentration and engagement. So you see it, you see kind of a theme here, right? Sun theanine does this, um, palm, pomegranate extract does this, Wayusa does this, Enzogenol does this, but they all do it in a slightly different way in a different part of the brain on a different family of neurotransmitters. So, you know, it's a, it's a, the end effect is that you feel better, you feel calmer, but you feel energetic and relaxed at the same time. And again, those sound like they should be opposite things, but they're very, very complementary to, to, to really get you to that optimal level of mental performance and physical performance. And that's the first thing that goes when we're under stress, right? When we're under stress, we can get anxious and fatigued at the same time. You hear people talk about being tired and wired, right? That is not where you want to be. You won't have, you, you, your, your mood will be bad. Your immune system will be suppressed. You'll just be in a bad state, especially the longer you're in that situation. If we can get you out of that situation, get you more into this sort of relaxed alertness, resilient phase, that's really what's going what's gonna to help, help a lot of people. Okay, so a lot of times what happens when we, so I've been studying stress physiology for 20 or so years. Um, we see a very common trajectory of what happens when people are under chronic stress for more than a couple of days. They very often will go from that stress to an anxiety kind of a kind of a description, right? Where now it's not just that they're stressed, now they're starting to get kind of like almost almost agitated and panicky. If you're there for more than a few days at that anxiety place, you can slip into depression where now you're just feeling kind of like un, unmotivated and sad and and just just blah all the time. And then you can go from there into burnout where you know sometimes when you're in burnout you start to actually get physical pain right like fibromyalgia you get debilitating fatigue like chronic fatigue you have you have no motivation you have no enjoyment of 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 anything right so that's a very common trajectory Str chronic stress anxiety depression burnout and i mean nobody wants to get onto that slippery slope and some people will be it'll be a steeper slope and they'll they'll go through those stages a lot quicker than other people right so we we definitely want to counteract those as much as we can as quickly as we can at, at whatever stage that you're at um so the next uh, a couple of ingredients that i want to talk about will will work on all of those right so if you're if you're burned out or depressed or anxious or stressed, these next ingredients will actually work on all four of those levels. Um, and so it almost doesn't matter which one you're at, the same kinds of ingredient profiles are gonna help you step back up the cascade and feel better and better and better. And that's gonna be, that's gonna be good for everybody. So the first one is this, uh, is this Rafuma. You can see a picture of it here. This is a plant from, from traditional Chinese medicine. We use a brand called Venetron because it has really good quality control and really good scientific evidence for this particular extract. And that evidence shows that if you happen to be in that depressed state, um, you can reduce that depression by about 30% in a month, four weeks, and you can reduce that depression index by 50% by, by two months, eight weeks, right? That's a huge, huge change in a short period of time with a natural option. You know, so if somebody is sort of in that state where you're, you know, you're, you're having the blues and your mood is down and your motivation isn't where, where it used to be, this would be something that can, that can pretty quickly, right, 
a month start pulling you out in some, in some significant ways. But here's the thing. This is a four week or an eight week time frame. We can't deliver this kind of an effect quickly like the sun theanine effect, right? That theanine effect is about an hour. The pomegranate effect is about two hours. Uh, some of the other effects that I'm gonna show you might be, might be immediate, might be a week, might be three weeks, right? So those different time courses of how we can help you feel better are important. It's what, it's, it's, it's what we refer to here at Amari as phased benefits, meaning we can help you feel better quickly in certain ways, tension, stress. We can help you feel better medium term in other, it, it, let's say a week, in terms of your focus and your brain fog and your memory and your ability to think and, and form strategies and things like that. We can help you with your resilience uh, to sort of match your level of stress in about three weeks. We can help you with your depression, like I'm showing you here, in four to eight weeks. And so eat, because each of those have a different time course, what we try to do with our products is build into them an ingredient profile that is gonna work a little bit to begin with, and then a little bit more, and a little bit more, and a little bit more. So this ingredient, Refuma, is in our Mood Plus product. We have, so this is gonna work at about a month, this anti-depression effect. We'll get the anxiety effect a little bit faster. We'll get the stress effect a little bit faster, et cetera, et cetera. So what people end up reporting back, whether it's Mood Plus, or whether it's, it's fundamentals, which is built with the same sort of philosophy of phase benefits behind it, you use it and you feel better quickly. And you keep using it and you feel more better and more better and more better and more better because all these different layers of different mood state parameters are manifesting based on those different time courses. So, you know, there is no other set of products on the market anywhere in the world that works that way. They were very strategically designed because we are the mental wellness company. We really wanna be the leader in this space. And in order to do that, we need to build products in a way that, is, that has never been seen before. So it was really fun to put them together. Um, in this particular product, you, I didn't mention this before, but you might've seen the little logo on the fundamental slide. That was, that was named the, the, the Nutra Award winner in 2018, meaning it was, it was voted as the best finished product in the entire natural products industry in 2018 when we launched it. This product, Mood Plus, was a finalist for Botanical of the Year in 2019. And the reason for that is because it helps with depression, like I'm showing you here, but it also helps with anxiety, it also helps with stress, and it also helps with stress resilience, all in the same product, right? And that's, you know, because it does so much in so many ways in one product, one of the reasons it was a finalist for Botanical of the Year. This ingredient, second main ingredient in Mood Plus, is one of my favorites. It's called Kana. Um, uh, maybe a more, a more appropriate name for it would be, would be part of its Latin name called Scalidium. Um, we use a brand called Zembrin, and it has anti-depression benefits, but we use it for its stress resilience benefits. You can see a close-up of the of the Zembrin of the of the Kana flower right here. You can see it growing wild here in the South African desert. We actually cultivate it in in greenhouses in South Africa, so we can control the growing conditions in terms of how much light and what the soil looks like and how much water and when we harvest it and how we extract it and all that kind of stuff, which I won't go into tonight. But the reason that we're using it and the reason it's one of my favorites is because it works acutely with one dose and it also works long term the more often that you take it. So I take this every single morning for this kind of a benefit. I I'm gonna read this to you. I love to read this little, this little bullet point because it really sums it up. A single dose of Zembrin attenuates reactivity within the part of the brain, the amygdala, that responds to threat and stress. And so what this means is that one dose, a single dose of this, when you are feeling stressed and panicky, can turn down that volume. If you're feeling stressed and panicky and you're at a 10 or an 11, this can attenuate or lessen that stress response so that you're, st you're still having a stress response. It's still appropriate to have a stress response. We don't wanna turn that down to zero. 
But if we can turn it from a 10 down to a seven or a six, then it's manageable, right? This is one of the reasons that you'll sometimes see the executives at Amari before we have to go on stage at one of our big events, running around backstage saying, hey, do you have any mood? Do you have any mood? Because we can, we, you can take one and in about 30 to 60 minutes, you can get this nice sort of calming effect that is just, is just ramping down your stress response a little bit, right? So very, very nice little effect that you can use sort of, sort of whenever, whenever is necessary. The really cool aspect of it is that when you use it every day, for here, you can see three weeks, it improves something called cognitive flexibility. This is one of the ways that we can measure stress resilience. If you have good high level of cognitive flexibility here, you can see that the, 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 the Zembrin group is significantly higher after three weeks than a placebo group. If you have good cognitive flexibility, you have good stress resilience. That means in a stressful situation, you'll have good decision making, good impulse control, good strategy formation. That kind of stuff enables you, when that stressful situation presents itself, it enables you to go, all right, let's figure this out. Let's, let's get through this, right? And that's exactly the kind of thing that we're in right now. People, in, instead of being in a stressful situation and people just going, uh-oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do, and panicking or freezing or, or just, or just shutting down, right? This kind of an effect allows you to show up to that stressful situation and get things done, right? And I think that's what a lot of people want these days. And this, like, you're not gonna get this kind of an effect from a synthetic pharmaceutical. Absolutely not. The best a pharmaceutical approach is gonna do is take your, take your sadness, take your tension, take your anxiety, and smush it and just mask it and just put a, put a wet blanket over it so you don't feel anything. This is a completely different way of thinking about the entire stress response system. This is getting you to be more resilient in the face of stress, right? So your stress is high, this is ramping up this other side of that equation and that's, you can only get that from, from, uh, from natural means. We're also combining um, those two ingredients, the Rafuma and the Kana, with ashwagandha. Um, this, is a, this is an herb that's been used for 5,000 years in traditional Indian medicine, Ayurveda, to help to lower stress response. So you can see here that 70% uh, reduction in feelings of stress, feelings of anxiety, and that's a very acute sort of an effect. You can feel it pretty quickly, but if you keep doing that, ashwagandha over time will actually reduce your exposure to stress hormones like cortisol, and that's a really good effect long Long term because that overexposure to cortisol can suppress your immune system and that can lead you to all the problems that we talked about at the beginning of this call so you know here you're you know it's it, it's very uh, um, like a like a direct link between your stress levels and your immune system right and if you can get that back in balance you get you get that dual benefit you feel better and you're protected at a higher level this last ingredient that's also in Mood Plus, Rolora, is a combination of magnolia bark and philodendron bark, and that is also in here for anxiety and tension. So you can see some of the mood state changes here. Um, it, it, it's also a very noticeable effect in terms of taking your stress off and taking your anxiety off. This has been studied too, and I'll just mention this very briefly, in uh, cases of stress eating. So a lot of times when we're chronically stressed, like we are most days right now, you'll find yourself at this time of night. So here in Utah, Salt Lake City, it's, it, just, it just came up on, on the top of the hour. So it's, a, it's 11 p.m. here. This is the time of night where someone who's been a little bit stressed all day long, chronic stress all day long, you're, you know, you're going to be at the, you're going to be at the pantry. You're going to be at the, at the cupboard. You're going to be at the, at the refrigerator because that stress and cortisol is now telling your brain to eat a lot of high calorie, high sugar, high fat comfort kinds of food, right? That's stress eating. This relora has been shown to lessen that response, partly because it just makes you feel calmer, partly because it lowers your cortisol. And if you have lower cortisol, you're gonna have less of that, of that appetite signal. 
Okay, so there's a there's a lot going on here across our across our product line. Um, I'll say a couple of words about sleep. Um, sleep is probably one of the most important things that any of us can do besides hand washing. Getting good sleep can really keep your immune system robust and strong. And uh, you know when 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 our bodies need to. Um, rebuild themselves and so that they come back stronger the next day. It's during deep sleep and it's during REM sleep that that happens. One of the things that's really unique about our Sleep Plus product is that it can improve the amount of time you spend in deep sleep and in REM sleep. Deep sleep is when your body recovers. REM sleep is when your brain recovers. And both of those are important for your ability to show up the right way the next day. So Sleep Plus is a really, really important product when we're, when we're under a lot of chronic stress like we are these days. Okay, so now I'm gonna shift gears again and talk a little bit more about how we can protect ourselves um, uh, kind of at that at that cellular level. So, you know, I talked about immune system, talked about gut integrity, talked about immune system priming. Um, we just talked about stress and sleep and how we can help there. Um, this product, this um, our, our GBX superfood helps to protect cells right down at the individual cellular level because it's got an ingredient in it that helps to in increase the production of heat shock proteins. Heat shock proteins in cells are one of the primary ways that those cells protect themselves from whatever is going to damage the cell. You know, we, in the laboratory, we use heat as a way to damage the cells. That's why they're called heat shock proteins. But any sort of stress, the kind of stress I've, that I've just been talking about can damage cells. Um, eating junk food and getting all that sugar can damage cells. Um, it, you know, uh, threats of infection can damage cells, et cetera, et cetera. So if you can make more heat shock proteins, you do two things. You protect yourself from that initial damage, but then you also enhance this process called autophagy, which is the cell's ability to repair itself clean up any residual damage that has slipped through. So you get a protection effect and you get a cleanup effect. And that's really important because that makes the cells work more efficiently and that gives you stress resilience at the cellular level that you can actually feel. When people supplement with this, this is the main ingredient that does that in the, in the, um, in the superfood product, this, 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 this ETAS, enzyme-treated Japanese asparagus extract, that's what stimulates the heat shock proteins. That's what stimulates the autophagy. When that happens in every cell times 10 trillion cells, you can actually feel that as this an edge coming off your stress. And so that might, that might help you sleep better, that might help you get through the day better, that, that will just help you function better if, you're, if your stress levels are lower because of that heat shock protein effect. With our, pro, with our product called Seed Fiber, this, we, use, we use this ingredient that I'm gonna talk about called AHCC to do this naturally support microRNA signaling. The reason we use it in this product primarily is because microRNAs are one way that the microbiome communicates with the brain and specifically communicates with the anxiety centers of the brain. So we use this to stimulate the signaling here to calm your anxiety. That's why it's in seed fiber. But because of that, we're also stimulating your immune, not stimulating your immune system, we're priming your immune system, but we're getting your immune system in a place where it's better able to send those signals across that axis like I was talking about before. So with Mentasync, we do it with beta-glucans from yeast, and we do it with alpha-glucans from mushrooms, fruiting bodies. Here we're doing it with alpha-glucans from a different part of the mushroom called the mycelium. The mycelia is the underground portion of the mushroom. It's really, really rich in these very particular alpha-glucans that can help with this microRNA signaling. Here's what it looks like. This is a very, very busy kind of, kind of a abstract kind of a slide, but I want to show you a couple of things. that This AHCC helps with the immune system vigilance, right? So we're better able to protect the body. It helps with gut integrity because it can help to kill off some of the bad bacteria in the gut. 
And if you get proper microRNA signaling, you can actually turn on some of the healthy protective genes in our human body. So it's protecting us at multiple levels, immune system level, gut microbiome level, genetic expression level. And that is a really, really unique set of benefits. And people look at that product sometimes and they go, oh, it's a fiber product. And they have no, and they go, well, maybe I'll use it because I need more fiber. Everybody needs more fiber. Um, but they have no idea of these other benefits that they're getting. They just know that they're feeling better. Okay. So, you know, now you know a little bit more about why that's so important for your immune system. Last two things that I want to say, and then I'm going to, I'm going to open it up for questions, um, is that, uh, you know, I mentioned, I, I mentioned a little bit before about, you know, um, the, the sort of three big things that are big concerns for people right now, your immune system, your stress levels, and now mental focus levels because the kids are home. Um, next month, I, I was supposed to be scheduled to give a presentation at a massive scientific conference in San Diego called Experimental Biology. And the presentation that I was gonna make uh, was about our Kids Mood Plus product, which is a, a product to help kids with mood and to help them with focus. One of the main ingredients in that product is this saffron extract. This saffron extract is something that, if you've got kids who are home from school right now and you know, trying to do their lessons online or with their own books or you're doing homeschooling because the school is closed, whatever the case may be, this is something you have to take a look at. So this saffron extract, before we got our hands on it at Amare, it had already been shown in clinical trials to be equivalent to Ritalin, that's what methylphenidate is, for ADHD. It was already shown in studies of te depressed teenagers to be equivalent to Prozac. Uh, because it can lower stress, it's been shown to be able to help with sleep enhancement because one of the big problems with getting enough sleep is that you're stressed out and you can't calm down enough to get good sleep. So it had a lot of really good data on it before we got our hands on it. But then we did a clinical trial of our own, and this is what I was supposed to present at that, at that conference next month. I'll end up presenting it here on a Zoom call you know, sometime, sometime in April. We saw huge improvements in focus, attention, mood, listening, tension, irritation. But we also showed huge improvements in mental performance when those kids were under stress like doing schoolwork, like being in social relationships, like being on sports teams, like being in, uh, you know, in, in, in an environment that is, that is, that is novel for them, which is, which is what they're all in right now. So this is something that is a very, very noticeable effect for parents to see in their kids. Uh, and it's, you know, it's something, you know, that we saw, you know, in 10 out of 10 kids that we, that we studied it with. So um, I already talked about the, the, the couple of these immune system pieces. And I just mentioned the kids. So with the kids products, right? I just mentioned this mood product. I mentioned that I mentioned the fundamentals data that we have with our adult product. We also have a kids version of fundamentals, and we have a kids version of our of our Vita GBX product, our multivitamin. So you know, parents should look at our kids pack and they should say, "Huh, what do I want to do here? Do I want to give my kids the 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 nutrition that they need to protect their cells?" the vitamins, the minerals, the amino acids, the phytonutrients, all that kind of stuff, uh, probably. Do I wanna give them the nutrients around the right bacteria and the right prebiotic fibers and the right other phytonutrients to help with gut integrity and to help with resilience across the gut-brain axis, probably. Or do I wanna give them that, that sort of amplification of stress resilience and focus and mood that I can get with Kids Mood Plus? Each of those are going to be beneficial. Your kids are going to get benefits from Vita GBX. Awesome. They're going to get other sets of benefits with, with, with Kids Fundamentals. Awesome. They're going to get other benefits with Kids Mood Plus. You, you could very legitimately go, well, th these ones are more important. These ones are more important. These ones are more important. Or you can do the, you can do the Kids uh, uh, Amari Kids Pack, which is all those products at a steep, steep discount so that you can get as much of that into your kids as possible. You know, so my kids, you know, both my kids are home now. My college age daughter had to come home because her campus is closed. My high school age son is home because his high school is closed. They are, they're taking these every single morning. In fact, they're taking these twice a day 
because it's it's super high stress right now. But those are the those are the important things to do across our product line. So you know I'm going to skip through each one of these little boxes for a second so I can get to this last slide. I mentioned when I did the webinar this morning, the women just said to me they're like, "All that science is great. Tell us what to take." Right, and so I, I basically ran through this, and I made this slide for you guys tonight. If you want to do this at the at the utmost level, well, if you want to do this at all, just take the products as directed. Right, you're gonna get those benefits. If you use fundamentals or kids fundamentals just once a day, you're gonna you're gonna do all the things that I just talked about. You're gonna get a stress resilience benefit. You're gonna get a focus benefit. You're gonna get a gut integrity benefit. You're gonna get an immune system priming benefit. You're gonna get all of that kind of stuff. If you wanna go a little more in depth, you can take extra menta sync. You could do extra mentabiotics. You could do double dosing of all of those if you wanted to. Perfectly appropriate to do that for this reason. More stress, more buffering, right? More resilience is needed. You could do Vita GBX or Kids Vita GBX to give those phytonutrients and those essential nutrients to help this, to help protect at the cellular level. Don't don't um, don't updose on these though. Make sure you get your morning dose. Make sure you get your evening dose. But with these kinds of nutrients, there's no additional benefit to going to you know double dosing or triple dosing. With the GBX Foods, we've got three products in that GBX Food line: Gut Brain Axis Foods. We have a protein that's going to help with your gut integrity. That's awesome. But the ones that you might want to do extra of is the superfood, so you get that heat shock protein effect, and the seed fiber, so you get that AHCC effect, which is immune system and gut integrity and, 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 uh, and, and, and genetic um, expression in a, in a sort of a healthy direction. Probiotics, because their effect in the gut is really important. In our particular probiotic product, we have five strains of bacteria, two bifidobacterium species, and three lactobacillus species. The lactobacillus species are the ones that are most associated with gut integrity and immune system priming, right? So that's a, that's a really nice product to add on if you want to. And then the mood product for stress and the sleep product, obviously, for, for sleep, you know? So, you know, it's, it's it, whenever I recommend products like this, I'm a little conflicted because like, you know, I don't want people to look at that, at that list and go, oh, I have to take all of these products that Dr. Talbot is talking about. Otherwise, I'm not gonna get the benefits. That's not the message at all. The message is that, any of these products can give you those benefits and it's up to you to decide where your biggest need is going to be. If you want to take all of them, fantastic. But if you want to focus and say, you know what, where my big issues are, it really is with, with sleep. And if I could get better sleep, that's going to make me stronger the next day. Or it's with stress or it's with you know, directly going to my immune system or directly going to my gut, you know, so you can make that choice. We try to give as much information as possible so you can have the information to make the best decision for whatever situation you're in. Okay, so with that, that's going to be my last slide. I'm going to stop sharing and then we should be back here. We can, we can all see each other. And what, what yes. I'm going to do is exactly what Robin said at the beginning. I'm going to go and look in the chat room and see if I can answer some of these questions. And then, you know, we'll, we'll invite people to unmute themselves and ask their own questions, okay? Yes, perfect. And, you know, before Dr. Sean, yeah. um, before they do that, I just want to say, you know, uh, for everyone out there who has watched the video, please take advantage of this opportunity to ask an expert about uh, any of your questions because um, there's a lot of information being shared out there right now about health and uh, things that we can do to avoid infection and all of this. And, and it's very confusing. You know, there, there's, there's contradicting information. But right. I think that every single one of us out here, you know, have been, has been very reflective recently of, you know, what is my state of um, immune system strength? I'm sure we've all been questioning that just for ourselves. One of the huge benefits of, of being a customer and a wellness partner of Amare is that we're connected to people like Dr. Sean Talbot who can give us factual, scientific information, credible information that um, 
leads us to, you know, it actually benefits our understanding of things. And so it, uh, I know for me, I know for me personally, um, and with my family, who has taken advantage of that Mentasync special, and I know I started taking Mentasync in double doses from mid-February, not because of the coronavirus, but just because I was around people who were, uh, who had the flu. So I doubled up on Mentasync because I was already knowledgeable about how that product worked. And so one of the benefits of being a, a preferred customer or even a wellness partner of Amare is that you are connected to this source of information, of credible scientific information that can help you make um, the best decisions for yourself and for your family. So with that in mind, please ask your questions. Dr. Sean, thank you so much. And um, I will mute myself so that you can ask the question. No, that's good. That's, that's great information, Robin. So there's a couple of questions in the chat room. I was just looking through there as you were, as you were talking um, that, are, that are all kind of along the same lines of um, what's something that we should not do and what are some of the some of the misinformation that's out there? So, like one of the one of the things that I'm seeing over and over and over again, which is absolutely wrong, is that people are saying on the internet what you want to do is stimulate your immune system, right? So, take lots of zinc, take lots of vitamin C, take lots of echinacea, take lots of you know all this other stuff. That's not what you should do, it, it, except in a very um, uh, um, isolated, limited sort of a situation, right? The only time you want to stimulate your immune system, which basically means take it from normal activity to above normal activity, is if you know you're infected. So if you know you have an infection, you know you have an upper respiratory tract infection, you know that you've be become exposed, it might be appropriate to stimulate your immune system for, for three or four days, right? take more vitamin C, take more zinc, you know, load up on echinacea or something like that. Because what that's going to do is get your immune system to just start swinging, right? It's, it's, like, it's, like, it's like starting a bar fight when you stimulate your immune system. Your immune system starts swinging and punching everything that it can find. But, and if there's viruses there, if there's bacteria there, if there's cancer cells there, fine. You're going you're gonna to fight them and you're going to hopefully get rid of them. But if you keep your immune system stimulated for more than three or four days, once that infection, once that invader is gone, now your immune system is gonna start to fight something else and it's gonna start fighting you. It's gonna damage your microbiome, it's gonna damage your gut lining, it's gonna damage your skin, it's gonna damage your, your joints. It's, that's, that's what we mean when we talk about autoimmune system conditions, when your immune system is in, is in overdrive or hyperdrive. You don't want that on a regular basis. A better thing to do is what I talked about when I talk about priming. Priming gets your immune system to that balance point where it's not overactive, but it's also not underactive. It's sort of like the Goldilocks approach, right? The porridge was, was too hot and too cold and just right. Priming is getting your immune system to be just right so it can fight what it needs to fight and ignore what it needs to ignore. It's a really, really different approach to immune system integrity, but it is absolutely the right way to go. Um, so, so there were a couple of questions that, that sort, of, sort of were on those lines. Um, um, there's one here uh, from Robin that says, someone's taken a prescription med that indicates a caution or avoidance of green tea. Should they not take mentabiotics? Uh, no, they'd be they'd be perfectly fine to take mentabiotics. Um, the the only the, if, if if there's some reason for them to not take green tea, um, that's 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 kind of strange. Um, except that really high doses of catechins, which is the one of the main active constituents of green tea, can change metabolism in the liver of certain medications. Um, even if you took our Energy Plus product, which has a base of matcha green tea, that's probably still not enough catechins to change drug metabolism. So I wouldn't think there'd be anything across our product line that would be a problem in that sort of a situation. Okay. Um, so somebody's asking about elderberry. Elderberry is one that I actually really like. So elderberry is sometimes billed or promoted as an immune system stimulator but it's actually not that at all. 
elderberry can do an act can, can be because elderberry is is high in those polyphenol flavonoids that i mentioned a couple of times on this call we don't use elderberry as a source of flavonoids we use pine bark and grapeseed and pomegranate and some of those things that i listed before um because they can they can have a direct antiviral effect but they have a priming effect they can take you from low back to normal but they're not going to take you from normal to high so they're not truly stimulators. so so something like that would be would would would, would be perfectly appropriate to take if you have it that's what i want to take when i when i here let me um right there i want to see if my let me mute that there's a little bit of background noise um and let me see that might be the ones that I have in the in the chat room right now. So elderberry, I got that one. Um, here, Joyce is asking a question. Um, what are your thoughts about reports of ibuprofen uh, or some BP uh, blood pressure meds worsening COVID-19 without enough studies? Um, well, I'm not sure about that. Well, I could think of I could think of um, you know some of these drugs can be detrimental. To, to gut linings, right? So if you're doing anything that's gonna damage the gut, you're automatically doing something that's gonna suppress the immune system. So it could be that sort of a linkage, but I, you know, I, don't, I don't think there's any, any hard data right now to show that taking an ibuprofen for your headache is gonna make you more susceptible to you know, coronavirus. I don't think, I, 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 think that's, I think that's probably hype. But you certainly don't wanna take a lot of ibuprofen on a regular basis because it's gonna be bad for your gut. Um, Let's see what else is in here. Um, would any of these products help with arthritis? Yeah, our, our Relief Plus product would, would, be, would be lovely for that because it's gonna, it's gonna lower the inflammation so your pain will be less, but by lowering the inflammation, it allows your body to get into a, into a place where it's better able to heal the damage. So a, co a really good combination to accelerate tissue repair would be Relief Plus to lower the inflammation and then superfood to accelerate that autophagy pr process to clean up the damage. That would be a really, really good one-two punch. Um, uh, Debbie's asking, do older people need to dose at higher levels? Um, not necessarily, and I'll, 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 read the, the, I'll read the rest of this and I'll get back to this. Um, and if money is a big issue, what's your best uh, suggestion for immunity meant to sink? Yeah, so uh, somebody asked me this this morning on the call too. If you had to pick just one product, what would it be? Um, and if, it's, if you just wanted to do the immune system piece, it'd be meant to sink. If you wanted to do a little bit more than that and get maybe not, so, so, so let's say, I was just going to think of how I can grade this, right? Menta sync is going to be very geared towards your immune system. Menta biotics is going to give you a nice balance of immune system direct activity and immune system through your gut activity. So if I had to pick one product, I think I probably would pick... Uh, it's a toss-up. Um, it is a toss up. If, if it was just an immune system, I'd pick Mentasync, okay? Um, but, but Mentabiotics does other things too. So it's one of my favorite products because it does so much in a, in a, in a concentrated place. Um, but do older people need to dose at a higher level? That's a really good question because we do know that one of the effects of aging is that your immune, is, is that your immune system goes down. Uh, your immune system gets less vigilant. Um, and we think that the, one of the reasons for that is because your microbiome gets less diverse. So we know that older people have, a, have, a, have, a, have an older microbiome. And there's some studies that show, and this is really intriguing data, the longest lived people, right? People from, you know, people who live in Okinawa, for example, right? They have a lot of people who live into their hundreds with, with really, really good health. They don't get sick. They're vibrant. They have good stress resilience. They have good, diverse, youthful-looking microbiomes. And as a result of that, they have really strong immune systems. So the question now is, which came first? Is it because they had a strong microbiome that gave them a strong immune system so they didn't get sick, so they lived longer? Or it was because they had a strong immune system that gave them a strong microbiome that prevented them from getting sick and they live longer. 
it, it, could be, it could be either of those. And so I look at those data and I go, huh, if I want to live longer, what am I going to do? I'm going to make sure I have a good microbiome and I have a strong immune system. And I know there's things that I can do for both of those simultaneously. Um, so I don't know if that answers your question, Debbie, but um, I, don't think, I don't think older people necessarily need to take a higher level, but they need to take a level in order to keep those two things strong. Okay. Um, I've got a comment here um, from Lori. My daughter and sister both encountered flu symptoms and having been on Amari, their immune systems were primed and the symptoms were absent within 24 and 48 hours. Fever, sore throat, shortness of breath. Thank you, Amari. Yeah, that is a great, great point. So, you know, th there's, there's the one aspect of it. If we can strengthen our bodies, maybe we don't get infected at all, right? Maybe we're able to completely ward that off. There's the other part, which is exactly what you just described, Lori, is that if you do get infected, your immune system, because it's primed, your immune system will be able to go, uh-oh, it got through the doorway, let's get rid of it as quickly as possible. And that's why you can turn that around in 24 or 48 hours and go, huh, I think I had a little touch of something, but that little touch of something doesn't cascade into that respiratory distress and you know, full-blown panic situation. You know, so that's, that's what we're talking about here. Um, Lorraine's asking, can a colonoscopy prep deplete gut microbiome? No, yeah, 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 it can. So um, any kind of, any kind of like, well, you know, antibiotics for sure are going to deplete your microbiome. Uh, colonoscopy preps will deplete your microbiome. Um, even things like heartburn drugs that people just sort of take willy nilly can really have a pro have problems downstream for the microbiome. Anything that you're doing, I mean, even even what's happening in your oral oral cavity with dental hygiene, you know, that's the first part of your gastrointestinal tract, right? So it's all it's all all connected. The good news about colonoscopy prep, though, is that the microbiome generally rebounds very, very quickly, much more so than if you've been on antibiotic therapy. A lot of times if you're on antibiotic therapy, we really have to do a concerted effort to get your microbiome to go back to where it needs to be. We need to you know, be eating our fermented foods and fiber and all that kind of stuff. If you just, if you just eat a varied diet and you supplement kind of exactly like I talked about tonight, you'll be able to come back from a, from a colonoscopy prep pretty, pretty quickly, okay? Um, and then just a, just a couple more here. Uh, would Relief Plus still be good to take at the moment with the coronavirus concerns? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no contraindications, no reason that you would, that you would wanna go off a Relief Plus with, with coronavirus around here at all. Yeah, that not, not, not related at all. Um, and is Relief a substitute for fever control meds? No. That's a really good question. So relief does a really good job on the inflammation and the pain side, but it doesn't have effects on the fever side. Um, and that's, a, that's, a, that's just a whole different, different side of how the body is doing things. But um, yeah, so, so I mean, you can take relief and it's not gonna affect your, it's not gonna affect your immune system, um, but, it, but, it, but it won't, um, it's not going to do. It's not going to do anything good or bad to your immune system directly, right? So think of Relief Plus as a whole as a whole separate thing, just for just for your pain levels, okay? And with that, that's everything. That's everything. I think. I think I got them all in the chat room. Um, oh, there's one here that says, "What is the best time to take GBX?" So GBX. Um, we use GBX in so many different, different of our products. It's Vita GBX. That could be what you're talking. If you're talking about Vita GBX, the multivitamin, the best time to take that is with food. So every morning, take your two Vita GBX with your breakfast. Every evening, take it with your dinner. And if you forget it at dinner, take it with a snack before you go to bed. That's going to improve the absorption of those vitamins and minerals. Okay. Um, and I think, I think that's everything. Thank you so much, Dr. Sean. That was awesome. My I, pleasure. To everyone out there who has uh, been a part of this webinar, I hope you have really gotten a lot of valuable information. I hope that at least the information we provided has um, brought some sense of comfort and um, confidence 
that what you're doing if you are already on Amare is helping to prime your immune system and putting in the best position should and hopefully you are not exposed, but should there be an exposure that you are in the best possible place um, within your body to handle it. But for those of you who are considering Amari, I just want to let you know that, um, you know, I hope this information has been helpful. I hope it's been, a, um, influ you know, at least, at least I've given you the information that you need to make a, a good decision. And one of the things that I personally have benefited from as being an Amari customer and now as a wellness partner is that we are connected to professionals who, like Dr. Sean Talbot, who is absolutely connected to the medical community, to the nutrition community, to the health community out there who are working right now, probably 24 seven to address the community of us to deal and handle with this um, situation that we find ourselves in, not only just physically, but mentally, right? This is a stressful situation, not just at the time, uh, at the moment, but in anticipation for what the fallout of this uh, situation is going to be. So um, everyone here at MR, if you have any questions about the products, um, please, uh, contact the wellness partner that invited you to this um, event tonight. And if you are, you know, if you're interested in even like, what is a wellness partner, right? I, I kind of talked a little bit at the beginning that I've decided to become a part of the business. Um, what that means is that um, Amari is a direct sales company and I have decided because I believe so much in the product and I wanted to, sh I was already sharing it with my family and friends that I decided, you know what, um, this is something that I, I think would be a, a, a very beneficial part of, uh, you know, what I do, uh, you know, for, for, res for, for added income, just for a little bit of added income, a side business. I mean, some people are actually making it a full-time business, but, you know, it, it, it's something that you can do in addition to uh, what you may be doing professionally or as a regular job. Um, and, and, I think that these challenging times is proving out that having a side gig may actually be helpful in some way because there's a little bit of you know money that's coming in for me right now and it's helping me to continue to spread the message and um, you know continue to provide my family with the supplementation that we are um, that's helping our health. So if that's it's something that you're interested in, and please um, contact the wellness partner that invited you to this event. Um, Dr. Sean, we so appreciate it. This is, I know it's late for you <laughs> out there in Salt Lake City. You are so dedicated to Hawaii. We so appreciate it. I really hope that you will be out here in October for your Ironman triathlon. I'm looking the forward to it. The entire thing blows away. Everybody will be um, healthy again. We'll get our, you know, uh, economy back uh, on track. And uh, thank you again so much. Thank you, everybody, for participating this evening. We so appreciate it. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>